Hi, everybody. Believe it or not, UPS found me. I figured, hey, you know what? Why not, why not do an unboxing? I don't do those too often. I already started, but I didn't get very far. So let's get started. Let's finish the job. I have been waiting for this and waiting for this. Because we live out in the middle of nowhere. Hopefully, you didn't get beat up too bad. It's not very heavy. Box was in good shape. <gasps> good one. I wasn't expecting that to happen. Bottom came on, on, came apart. I guess that's what the straps are for. Okay. Washing machine. Not very big, but we can do the small stuff. I might be able to do one pair of jeans in here, but it'll wash shirts, it'll wash underwear. And uh, I don't have a problem using a solar dryer. So this will help us to minimize our trips to town until a later date we can get something a little bit better. But for right now, this will help out a lot. Um, there's several people on, on uh, YouTube that, I don't know if they had this exact one. It might have been a little bit bigger, but the price was right. It was under $100. So I figured that would get us through. The worst of it anyway. So now no more stinky Mom H. Honey can still be stinky, but not Mom H. Morning, everybody. Well, it's going to be a sunny day today. High of 63. So I'm going to get some wash done. So here's my sh sh machine. It's not very big but it'll do. I've got the wash going in there. Okay. Got the timer set for the highest amount because I want to make sure they're well agitated. Okay. And um, when that's done, then I will take them out. I'll wring them out a little bit, dump them into another container, and I'll throw another few items in there. Okay. So I'm going to be using the wash water uh, a couple of times. Okay. Um, and uh, then when I've got them all washed, I can do rinse water. Now the rinse water I have to change more, more often. Um, I've got, uh, we got plenty of rain uh, this week, yesterday. So I've got lots of rain water to use to wash my clothes with. So that's what I'm doing. Because we're still trying. Okay, what I did is I took some of the clothes from the wash tub and put them in the spinner part. Okay, so that'll wring up some of the water. I really need to have this elevated a little bit so I can use gravity to, uh, to drain the, the spinning water back into the, uh, I can put it in a bucket and then dump it back in the wash basin. I want to mention too that the, um, I've got a lot of suds in there. I didn't think I put that much soap in there, but apparently I still had too much soap. So it really, uh, you really don't need much more than like a tablespoon, if that, of soap in that size basin, okay, because it really suds up big time. I discovered that putting the washing machine at the 
front edge of the, of the porch is working out quite well. It's a good height for me. Um, I've got the last two items that I'm going to be washing today because I don't have much clothes my space. Um, if I had them in here, uh, everything else is over here waiting for me to put through the rinse cycle. So, I don't know if you can tell how dirty this water is, but it's really dirty. And I wash mainly uh, the work clothes I wear around here, okay? So, they kind of really got scuffy. So, anyway, um, so once that's done, I'm going to drain it out, and then I'm going to rinse it. 